Hi, my name is Jody Ettenberg and my site is legalnomads.com. In 2017, after nearly a decade of building a business I loved, focused on exploration and curiosity and food, a spinal tap derailed my life and left me disabled with a chronic CSF leak. I go into what a CSF leak is in the text of the Patreon, but suffice it to say that I went from the total freedom to live and eat and create anywhere I chose in the world to the itty bitty small. I'm building this Patreon now as a means to receive additional support in this new stage of my life and my business, and at a time where I can't physically work the way that I used to. Legal Nomads wasn't even meant to be a business at all. It was created in 2008 as a way to keep friends and family updated on what was supposed to be a one-year sabbatical for my career as a lawyer. But that career sabbatical turned into a beautiful new entrepreneurial journey, one that was very unexpected, and one that led to things like a book and freelance writing, public speaking, some products, and all of you, a thriving, amazing community of people who are insatiably curious and, like me, love to experience the world through food. That Spinal Tap didn't just end my ability to work on a business I adored in places I called home, but it also really changed my day-to-day -day living, fundamentally. Now, whenever I stand up, including at the moment recording this video for you, I'm in incredible amounts of pain. This despite looking pretty normal, which is the conundrum of invisible illness. But I assure you, I am in a lot of pain, and because of that, I'm limited in the amount of time I can stand up in, in any given day. I can't bend or twist my spine or, or lift things, and I can't tie my own shoes. And after a lifetime of pretty fierce self-reliance, I can no longer live independently anymore. This world right now for me is very limited physically, as you can imagine, but the curiosity that fueled that life of travel is still there, and it guides me now on an inward journey, one that connects me to you, my community, in deeper and, and more meaningful ways, and I really hope to keep sharing, which is where this Patreon comes in. You've asked for the Patreon now for a few years, some of you pretty forcefully, and you wanted to provide me with a stable income at a time where I couldn't physically do the work that I used to do. It's because of that that I have structured the Patreon differently to travel and food Patreons generally. Instead of graduated rewards, depending on the amount you donate or sign up for, this is a support-only Patreon. So whichever tier that you choose, you're going to receive the same goodies, the same rewards, the same updates as everybody else. And I did this because I really didn't want to commit to delivering something that my output or pain levels didn't let me deliver. I would much rather absolutely be sure that whatever I promise, I can give you as I've intended. The Patreon is going to go toward this general support, as I said, but also towards specific projects that I am excited about. For starters, redesigning Legal Nomads. Right now, the slogan of the site is telling stories through food, which I am clearly not doing. I am also not a lawyer anymore, and I am no longer a nomad, so I'm looking forward to my homepage reflecting a little more of my present experience. I'm also planning to launch and produce a new podcast, one that answers life's really tough questions that you've asked me over the years. Things like how to handle anxiety or how to be more resilient and also how to sleep better, which remains the most popular question I've received over time. So if you have enjoyed my soup recommendations, my many links I've shared, the ad-free content on Legal Nomads or my most recent pieces about surrender and grief, I would love you to be part of this new Patreon community. And I'm also really excited to have a community within uh, the Legal Nomads world, one that is different, right, than anything I've done before. It includes casual sharing behind the scenes access, things that are a different experience of back and forth than the usual ways that I've produced my work. I also really want to thank each of you for being there during this incredibly, extensively terrible time in my life. When this first happened, I, I wasn't sure if my community would come along with me for the, the ride wherever it went. But instead, not only have you come along with me, you've sat with me in the mess and the grief and, and the shock when this first happened. 
you've been so supportive and I honestly don't think I could have processed the trauma of all of what's gone on as effectively if it wasn't for all of you, this beautiful tapestry of people lifting me up from all around the world. And throughout that time, you've also shared your stories with me of love and loss and chronic illness. It's just been a really humbling experience. Life really just changes in a moment. And we know this intellectually, but when it happens, it truly is a reckoning. I'm so grateful to have you all by my side as I go through this time in my life. So I hope to see you in the members only section. And thank you so much for watching.